it's not about race and it's not about gender with the media. It's not about race and it's not about gender. They'll keep telling you it's about race and it's about gender, but it's not. Because if you are on the left, the media will circle the wagons. Now, if you're a woman on the left and if you're a black on the left, you're a white on the left, doesn't really matter, an Asian on the left. If you're on the left, the media will go to the wall to protect you, to, to keep negative information about you from the public, to bury as much as they can, to avoid any topics that cast aspersions upon you, if you're on the left. What matters is the left, the socialist stuff. It doesn't matter the race, the gender, the whatever, right? Mm -hmm. On the other hand, if you're on the right, then they'll attack you no matter what. Like if you're black, they'll attack you. If you're gay, they'll attack you as, as Milo has sort of experienced uh, over, uh, over the years. If you're black, they will attack you or at the very least they'll fail to defend you. I mean, you could look at the, the different experiences of multiple accusations of sexual assault and rape. One of them is Bill Clinton. The other is Bill Cosby. Bill Cosby is more on the right. Bill Clinton is more on the left. So Bill, Bill Clinton gets a free pass. Bill Cosby, uh, well, the uh, whoever accuses him must be true. And we're going to gather all these women. We're going to put them together on a magazine cover and we're going to boom, boom, boom. Have they ever got all of Clinton's accusers? No. on the cover of a magazine and said we must believe them because it's true and reported endlessly on every accusation. No. no. Because Bill Clinton, he's white, but he's on the left. So he's, he's of the protected class. Bill Cosby is black, but he's on the right. To, I don't know if he's a conservative or not, like officially, but uh, he does talk about you know, the, the black community fixing its own problems. And of course, if the black community does fix its own problems, which of course we all want to have happen, then the Democrats won't have much to sell them anymore. So there is no particular incentive uh, for the media to help the black community solve their own problems. So anyone who comes along with um, suggestions that will help the black community fix their own problems as um, uh, you can, uh, the pound cake speech, you can look this up and, and there's other speeches that uh, Bill Cosby made. And Bill Cosby's very success, of course, and Bill Cosby had a very, very high IQ as well. We've got a whole presentation about him. Or if you look um, at women, uh, just if you really want to be horrified by, by this language, look up what Bill Maher, M-A-H-E-R, was saying about Sarah Palin. He used the see you next Tuesday word. I mean, just hammered on her. Look at how the media treated Michelle Bachman. Michelle Bachman versus the way that they treat Hillary Clinton. Michelle Bachman, it's a totally different planet. So wow. they'll try and tell you it's about gender and it's about race and it's about is sexual orientation. It has nothing to do with any of those things fundamentally. Those are just the covers. Those are the distractions. Those are like the, the pickpocket, the two-person pickpocket team, like the one bumps into, the other one reaches in and takes your wallet. Well, it's all about promoting the left and attacking the right. And this is why the right generally wins, because they're stronger. They're swimming upstream. And so what it does is it punishes people for being on the right and rewards people for being on the left. It has nothing to do with moral considerations whatsoever. And what it does is it tries to lure people into the protection of being on the left. Because if you're on the left, you can do just about anything and get away with it. Like Anthony Weiner, who, you know, tweeted his junk to like a bunch of women or whatever. They tried to rehabilitate him. That's Uma Abedin's husband, yeah. um, I, husband, I think quotes. But um, they tried to rehabilitate him. I was reading this article about, you know, he's fighting his way back from his addiction and he's going to do good and he really cares and he's going to help the poor. And then he said, I think he did something else ridiculously <laughs> inappropriate. And then they gave up on him. But they'll even try to re rehabilitate. So what they, what the media is saying is, come to the, they're like Darth Vader with the dark side. Come to the left. You will be protected. We will always protect you. Whoever accuses you shall be attacked in return. We shall troll everyone who speaks negative of you. You can strangle hobos and we shall cover up the bodies with our tears of sympathy, pretend sympathy for the poor. Yeah. And so people are lured like a gravity well into the leftist protectionist magic circle. And then they say, and should you go to the right, should you join Luke and the rebellion, we shall train all of our lasers upon you and you shall never have a moment's peace. And even if you don't do anything, we'll attack you. But on the left, if you do anything and everything, we'll defend you. And so there's this weird distortionary gravity well that pulls people, Roar! you know, like the, 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 the right is like Ceres, the little asteroid, and the left is like Jupiter, hundreds of times bigger than the Earth, pulling people in, come to our protective umbrella. Wouldn't you want to go in for the big deadly fight knowing that you can't ever be hit? Isn't that great? You know, whereas if, 
if you're a right uh, ring person and you're going into the fight, I mean, not only will they tie their hands behind your back, but they'll drop a piece of masonry on your head and call it a fair fight. So, yeah. um, <laughs> did it, you know, when they start, it's not race baiting. It's not race baiting because the degree to which the left race baits uh, blacks on the right, oh, man, they're brutal. It's got nothing to do with race, nothing to do with gender, nothing to do with sexual orientation, nothing to do with anything, nothing to do with Islamophobia. It's all about the left and their promotion of power. Does that help at all?